What's going on guys, Wiggly here. Today I'm going to show you an easier way you can duplicate cars for friends on GTA 5 online after the patch 1.12. So first off, the person giving the car has to start up their own invite only session and they're going to have to park the car that they want to give in front of the other person's garage. Once the car is set, the person receiving the vehicle wants to go ahead and walk inside their garage. Once you're inside the garage, you're going to want to have your friend who's standing on the outside to start up and host a deathmatch. It doesn't matter which deathmatch it is, as long as he hosts a deathmatch. From here, you're going to want to go and sit in any insured car that you don't really care about because you are going to be losing it. What this does is it transfers the insurance from the shitty car that you have to the nice car outside that you're going to be duping. So once your friend has gotten into a hosted deathmatch lobby, he's going to want to invite you to the job. While you're sitting in your car, you're going to want to open up your phone, navigate to the job, and on the white screen where it says you can confirm to go to the job, you're going to want to press A and right trigger at the same time and hold them in. If done correctly, you're going to go to a black loading screen and you're going to hear the garage door opening up. As soon as the garage door stops, you're going to want to wait a couple seconds and then just let go of A and right trigger. But when you're in the lobby, as soon as you get the chance to quit, you're going to want to quit and go back to the free mode. What should happen is you'll spawn inside your garage and you're going to want to look at your minimap so you know which direction to run in. But you're going to want to run outside the garage and then get inside your friend's vehicle. You're going to want to do this part fairly quickly because if you do it too slow you're going to get spawned back in the garage and lose the car. But once you get spawned back in the garage you're going to get kicked out of the car. Go ahead and run back outside the garage and out on the street you should see a tracker on your minimap. This is the same car. It is yours now. It's totally insured. It's got the tracker on it. If you want, you can always go down to the Los Santos Custom Shop and soup it up to however you want it. So if you guys enjoyed this glitch, make sure to leave a like on my video and also subscribe to my channel for some more GTA 5 content, glitches, and cool tips and tricks. So until next time guys, peace. Thanks for watching guys, make sure to smash the like button and subscribe. Also make sure to tune in to some of my other videos. Moving like the speed of sound on the ground can't stay in one place